All right, guys, welcome back to the channel, man. Today, 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 we have our first 32 user college football league, and I'm the Maryland Terrapins, man. Excited to get into the series. Um, also, a little apprehensive, to be honest with you. Uh, you can't, obviously, there's a ton of teams in college football, and right now, like, building your own schedule is, like, broken in the game, so you can't do that, unfortunately, so... It's going to be really a mix of like CPU games versus real life players. Um, honestly, the big thing in this game is scouting, really. And so we'll do a lot of scouting. We'll build up a great team, hopefully take these Maryland Terrapins to, to victory. All right, let's get into it, man. All right, guys, let's give you guys a quick introduction of the team, man. At coach, we have Taylor Sapio. We have Mr. T-Sap himself as the coach of the Maryland Terrapins. I feel like it was only right, man. Oh, the T-Sap has to be the coach here. Um, and yeah, guys, I picked Maryland because I'm from Maryland. Right? I didn't go to UMD, but I went to UMBC, which we don't have a college football team, but maybe we create a team and try to leap in the victory. If you guys wanna see that, if you wanna see me rebuild my alma mater and try to build a great football program, let me know in the comments below, but let's go over the Maryland Terrapins current roster. And honestly, guys, I don't really know anything about this roster. I don't watch college football. But we do have MJ Morris. He has step up, decent abilities, step up pull down from Billy Edwards. He is a junior though, compared to MJ Morris who's a sophomore. Speed wise though, Billy Edwards is a lot quicker. What else do we have? Yo, low key, Jaden, was it Jaden Sare? 5'11", scramble, Scrambler from Maryland. He's a magician, a mobile resistance, and extender. I think we actually start. This is a hot take already. I think we start Jaden. I mean, he's a 71 compared to a 77. He is a year younger. He's quicker, which speed is obviously super important in this game. You guys, you already know. His throw power isn't the best, but I mean, his accuracy, it's, it's honestly not bad. I'm going to try him out. Jaden Sare. QB1. I'm going to try him out see how it works for us. It could be a terrible mistake and we go back to Billy Edwards, but for now, for now, okay? I'm going to go Jaden. At running back, man, we have Roman Hemby, also from Edgewood, or also from Maryland. Edgewood is actually close to where I grew up at, funny enough. Uh, same county, Hartford County. A lot of Maryland locals, which we love to see, man. We have this guy, Dejon Williams, who, freshman, Okay, interesting abilities. I don't really know too many abilities, but he's one of the only ones who gets abilities, and he's very quick. 96 Excel, 92 speed. I think he might back up Hemby. Hemby, I think, keeps the starting spot. He's just so much better than uh, Williams, but maybe we work it in a little bit, like a one-two combo. I kind of like that right there. We also have Nolan Ray, who has 360 um, freshman. Okay, 5'11", 5'11", 5'10", 6'4". Okay, I like the running back units right now. Could look to upgrade in the future though. Um, fullback, I'm, I don't really plan on using a fullback to be honest with you. But looking at receiver, man. We have Ty Felton, 91 speed, 91 XL, 83 overall. He has double dip and a few mental abilities. Who is this? 90 speed, 92. I mean, no crazy like speed demons on our team. Oh, oh, this is corner. Getting in the corner territory. Yeah, I mean, not much speed, honestly, on the offense side of football. 91 speed. Oh, I don't like that. It means I have to actually make raids, bro. And our top two guys are both seniors. So we need wide receiver. All right, I'm in, a, in my head right now, I'm making a list of what we need. And wide receiver is pretty much number one, bro. We, yeah, we need wide receiver very, very badly. At the tight end position, we have Preston Howard, LeBron. Oh, <laughs> I thought that, I thought it was a LeBron. I thought he hype. LeBron Husbands and Dylan Wade. Um, I mean, 79 speed, 76 overall. Both sophomores, redshirted. I guess Preston Howard in that spot. Uh, and then the O line. Take a look at the O line. We need a left tackle. Oh gosh, we need a left tackle. Okay, we have a right guard playing left guard. It looks pretty decent, actually. Okay, O-line looks... O-line actually looks pretty solid. They are... I feel like all getting a little bit older. 
so we can both be drafts up. But that, I mean, not draft, but, you know, pick them up. But I don't hate what I see. I don't hate what I see, man. The D-line is a little bit weak, especially at the interior. Oh, no, just all over. Very, very weak. Um, we do have Ruben Hippol Hippolyte. I don't know. An absolute dog, though. 86 overall, 82 speed, 88 excel. And he has some good abilities in wrap-up, hammer, and aftershock. But, unfortunately, he is a senior. So, again, our good players are looking a little bit old. Oh, who's this? Michael Harris. 88 speed. I do like that. 89 excel. And only a sophomore. So, okay. Corners. Is it, is it bad? Is it bad? 84 overall with Jalen Husky. Great abilities. So, we have one kind of, like, good lockdown corner. Um... Lionel Whitaker, not bad. Juniors up top, so not not terrible. Okay, but we do need corner for sure. Um, somebody to fight for that TB three, probably slot position. And at the safety spot, kind of the same thing. Yeah, strong safety at top of mind. Kicker. How are we looking at kicker, man? Need a kicker, I think. I don't know. I don't know, man. Team looks pretty decent. I'm gonna go ahead and do the depth chart and then we'll look at um, recruiting a little bit as well. All right, man, fix the depth chart. Let's go to recruiting. So if you guys watch my other video, uh, you guys know I was terrible at recruiting. However, I watched the Bengal video, shout out Bengal. So I think I can now recruit a little bit better. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll show you guys my board after I do some initial recruiting. All right, guys, I just made a board. I have about 30 targets out of 35, and which I think is the right way to do it, um, if I'm not mistaken. So then now I just have to go in, spend all of my hours, kind of divvy it up accordingly on the guys who I really want. And according to the videos I've watched, guys, which I'm, I'm learning, I'm trying my best, all right. Um, again, according to the videos that I watch, you want to go kind of you, you want to spend all your hours, right? You want to offer scholarships pretty much immediately. And again, spend all your off, spend all your hours every single week, which I didn't know. I didn't do that last time. So now I know I'll definitely be doing that. Um, obviously these five-star athletes probably won't be too, too interested enough to be honest with you. Um, you guys can see most of the people in this league took the bigger teams, Florida Gators, Miami U, like at Alabama, Again, took a lot of the, the really good teams, and we're we're, we're we're Maryland. All right, not a bad program, but not one of the best. So as you guys can see here, for like Dylan Pitts, for example, is wide receiver, uh, six feet tall. We do have a lot of interest from him, uh, strictly because honestly, we are a Maryland program, and he wants to be close to home. So people like this, and we really gotta like prioritize. To be honest with you, uh, also realized that the little clock to the to the right is zero to 60 so that means i can offer up to 60 things so i could do like friends and family and then like dm the player stuff like that i can do anything up to six i can do like another one too all right search social media yeah exactly so that's 40 right there and that's what we basically want to do to try to get some of these guys interested in us early like this guy for example no engage. He's out of Norfolk, Virginia. I mean, he's only a two. St oh, wait. I forgot. I forgot to actually scout this guy. Listen, I'm still learning. Okay, I forgot to actually scout this guy. So, like, if you take a look at how he actually is, 92 speed. He's actually a gem, which means he's actually like a like a hidden gem. Pretty good mentals. Can't develop and trade, and no abilities. It looks like, but he's 92 speed, and he's six five. So that's definitely somebody we want going forward. We'll definitely keep up with uh, Dylan Pitts for sure. And then yeah, like this guy like Nolan Gage, he doesn't look to be that crazy to be honest with you. He, he looks he looks pretty bad actually. But either way, I'm gonna offer him a scholarship and DM the player just because we need to fill up the roster and I don't really see myself getting too many great prospects just because of the, the program I'm at. Um, so we have to be kind of, you have to be smart pretty much. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this for everybody. Um, if I find anybody who's actually like solid, I'll show you guys. Also guys, kind of funny. I think there's a glitch right now where it's like, it says DC is in Maryland, which you know, obviously DC is a district, Maryland's a state. None of the, they're not like, 
like DC's not in Maryland, technically. Um, but it says it is, so I feel like it helps in my favor because I'm getting more prospects who like want to play close to home, and it says you know we're in the same state basically. So like this guy Paul Dicker who actually looks pretty good. Um, ooh, actually, 89 speed, 92 agility, not that great actually. He's a four-star athlete. I, I'd still put an offer on him, obviously, but it's gonna help us get him because again, DC, Maryland. Hi right, guys, this guy right here, Cordell Abraham, actually looks pretty solid. 91 speed, zones pretty good, man coverage not the best, but we are pretty much up there. I'm gonna win an offer from a scholarship. Uh, put some action out on him. Content, I guess for now, we'll do that. I um, only have 20 hours left, so gotta kind of play this one smart. I'm trying to target people who are in Maryland right now and who obviously have interest in us. Like. I can offer a few more people scholarships for now, just so it kind of like, you know, gets our name out there. Like this guy, Edgewood, safety, a lot of big names want him. I don't even know if we'd be able to get him, to be honest with you, but open off on him. He is from Maryland, so hopefully just a little bit of a hometown, you know, hometown looking. Like this. Oh man, this guy looks... I can't do much for now. I'm gonna search social media. So that's it guys. I mean, we'll get more hours starting next week, but I kind of like where we're at right now. Um, kind of scouted the entire board just to see who all was really out there. Maybe we gotta be a little bit more um, picky when it comes to our, who we're scouting, because those hours did not go very far. If you look at Taylor Sapia, um, active perk, extra XP for signing somebody. All right, we can't afford any of this, but, but, these are some things we can get in the future once we unlock that, wait, okay. In four bowl games, what the hell? Yearly XP, getting XP when player lady covers up. Oh well. Wow. All right. Hi right, guys, I mean, that's the scouting right there done again. What are the Terrapins? Taking on UConn our first game. I actually haven't really played much of this game still. So it'll be interesting to see if I'm actually out here winning games or not. Um, if you look at the team schedule, it's our schedule for the season, man. Obviously we come in with a bye. And then, I mean, we don't actually, we won't actually play an actual user until week eight when we take on USC. Then Oregon, Week 11, Iowa, and then Penn State to close out the season. That's gonna be a fun game. But I mean, listen guys, we're just here to rebuild this team, rebuild this program, take UMD, bring in the greatness, let's get into it, man. All right, man, I had to go yell at my cats. I missed the freaking walkout, but the boys are buzzing. We're taking on UConn. Let's see what we can do, man. Let's see what we can do. Hopping into the game here, and we're already in it. Playing the moment. Third down and four, we have the ball. Can you guys see everything? I don't know where the best place to put my face cam is. I don't know if that's a good spot. Oh, definitely, definitely not. Maybe up top. Well, I don't like that, but I don't I don't like that. We'll try it though, we'll try it. Some quick slants. Oh yeah, dot, dot, pray there, pray. Who's that? Who's, hold on, I gotta check the, I gotta check my depth chart real quick. Who was that? Prater. Okay, Prater was the other senior. Okay, Ty Felton, Prater. Okay, God, listen, it's gonna take me a while to learn these guys. So bear with me, all right. But good catch from Prater. Let's get back into it. Let me stop pausing. Oh, all right. Looks like we had a field goal situation. Don't know what happened, but unable to get the job done, but. Let's just make sure we hit that kick right there. Easy money. Three, zero. Let's go. Red zone alert. Oh, back on offense somehow. All right, let's go, man. All right, Hemby in the backfield. Got the got the the speed stare at quarterback. Let's see if we can get out the pocket right here. Hit the block. He's so fast, bro. He is so fast. Yo, no, no, no. Sorry, he might be the truth. He might be the truth. Oh my gosh. Jaden Sare. Sare? Sare. He might be the truth. That's all I know. 
Fourth and two. They're going for it. Come on, Thomas. I don't know why I went man. I don't know why I went. I don't have the corners for man. They score a touchdown. All right, we don't have the corners for man. Listen, now we know. Uh, third down and six. Red zone scissors. The Reed's going to be either RB. This is a cover three. Maybe even A on the flat. Might even. Come on. I mean, that was a beautiful read. Not the best throw from Jaden. Listen, Jaden's accuracy isn't the best, but it's going to get us there. All right, it's going to get us there. Back in the red zone, though. Jaden and Hemby in the backfield. Let's see if we can do it here. Block. 58. 58. Hit that block for touchdown. All right. Should be able to scramble out to the right here. Oh, gosh. Throw that away. All right. That edge disengaged pretty quickly. We're good, though. Easy. Let us go, man. Into the end zone for a touchdown. 17-7 is the score. Let's keep it going. Oh, oh, oh. take a timeout. Take a timeout. 17-14. We have the ball, but we're... I mean, how many timeouts we have? How was our last timeout, huh? Six seconds? Uh, if A isn't open, maybe just throw it away. Oh my gosh, that was actually such a laser. Terrible throw from Jaden right there. Kind of sold us a little bit. We're going to try to kick. Beautiful. Nice. Love to see that. All right. We're good, man. Up six. Let's go. This could be man right here. If it's man, check RB. I thought he'd be able to get out faster, bro. Going for it. Coach, you don't gotta tell me twice, man. Trust in me. Are we gonna go far? Easy. Felton. Oh, Hemby, great block. Oh, keep your feet in. Keep your feet in. Yo, Jaden's kind of dealing right now. I'm not gonna lie. Jaden is kind of dealing. All right, I didn't realize this was a first and goal from like the five. I'm gonna go run the ball right here. Hemby, follow the blockers. Follow the blockers. Hemby. All right, good fight. Good fight. Let's go. Hurry up. Let's go, hurry up. Let's pass the ball, see if we can get out with Jaden. I think we scramble to the left, and it's a touchdown. Jaden, Jaden, he's too fast, bro. His speed is actually ridiculous. I keep looking down here, the screen's up here. His speed is nasty, bro. We might have something right here. Genuinely, we might have something. We're up 33 to 14. We're piling it on right now. That's what I love to see, boys. Oh, he caught it. Did he catch it? Okay, I didn't think he caught the ball right there. I guess he caught it, though. Okay, Jaden, his arm isn't the best. Like, I'm leading the receivers, and it's kind of going all over the place. But, honestly, it's fine. We're going we're gonna to work with it. We're going to work with it. With Hemby fighting the way he's fighting, I don't know if we can be beat. Not going to lie. Not going to lie to you. Go quick slant, see what we do. Dot him up. Oh my gosh, not Scott bumped like crazy. Alright, let's play it smart. Give the ball. Oh, McDonald comes in for Hemby. Alright, I don't know if I love that, but we'll see. Outside wide. Right, it's easy, it's easy. Let's go. Alright, finally we get to play some defense, bro. I think I played defense only once this game. We do have, I don't know this guy's name. I'm going to call him H2 though, because, you know, obvious. Oh, God. Sackles. All right. I mean, oh, well. We're good. Wow. I mean, great dot. Quarterback throws it right where the blitzers were coming from. They're going for an onside kick. Let's go ahead and uh, pick that football up, please. Thank you. That's me. Not. We have space. We have space. Oh. It wouldn't let me like actually control it right there. It was weird. We still got it done right there. I want to take, yeah, I want to take over for the rest of the game here. I want to get my reps in. All right. I want to make sure when we actually play a, an opponent in week freaking 18, I'm, you know, actually decent. I'm actually decent. All right. 
So hurry up right here. Flip the play. I do like the fact that you don't need like hot bar master. You can just kind of call whatever, put whatever on the field. I do like that. Oh, cook him. Cook him. Let's go, baby. Off the line. Prat, pr Prater? Prater? Oh, shoot. Doesn't matter. Kick is up. Kick is good. Prater. That's what I'm talking about, dude. All right. Way to go out there and make a play for your freaking quarterback. That's what I love to see, man. That's what I love to see. Push it flat. I took it. I took it. I took it. Good defense. Good defense. Jalen Husky right there. I do like how it shows you who made the play at the end of the, uh, like at the start of the next play. I think that's really cool. It's a great feature. Oh, shoot. I got cook. Nope. We're good. We're good. He's not running. Send them. Send them. That's too much time, boys. I actually did play one game with Maryland online uh, before I started the series. And I did notice that the D-line doesn't get any pressure. So, D-line's going to be super important. Get, like, an edge rusher. Mmm, good route. Good tackle. Do it into a lot of traffic right there. Yeah, H2, make a play, make a play. Make a play, H2. I was guessing, kind of guessed wrong right there. They're not taking any timeouts. I feel like they're content just walking away with, uh, with the L right here. Oh, yeah. All right, that was definitely a pick. It, like, stopped me. It's fine, bro. Jaden Saray? Sare has an absolute masterclass of a performance, man. Um, I think that's at 400 yards with four touchdowns. This game is over, man. GG's to the Yukon Huskies. I'll see you guys in the post game. All right, if you look at the stats right here, right now, I mean, Jaden, the boy, with good abilities too, man. I mean, two touchdowns on the day, 404 yards, and that's just passing. He also had two touchdowns on the ground. I mean, what more can I say, man? Hemby, not the best game. 2.9 yards a carry, which, I mean, it's whatever. Um, Felton, the senior, had a great game. So did Prater. I want to probably Prater. Um, not a bad game as well. Howard getting involved, six, carry, six catches, excuse me. I like the way the team is playing, bro. I was a little bit nervous using the Terps because, you know, the, the, not the best team. But I think we'll be able to uh, actually kind of compete. Not going to lie. All right. We did get some coach points. I'll wait to use that until next week. I think like, you know. Mm, yeah, I think I'll wait to use that till next week. I think, guys, I'll be doing like two games per episode. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if I'm doing anything wrong or if you want me to recruit a certain position. Appreciate you guys, man. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.